We're in the Caltech booth. Highly requested this year. Highly requested. Of course, because you guys have new stuff out, man. Yeah, Andrew. Tell the people what you guys have that's new out there, like they don't already know. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, we got uh, two new weapons that we're uh, releasing this year. You want to start with the KS7? Yeah, KS7. It's our, looking good. I like the retro look of this, man. Thank you. Yeah. Um, our, we, we, you know, we like to make things look kind of cool and whatnot, yeah. so right. that spills over into everything we do. But, um, yeah, it's uh, just a, basically a single tube shotgun instead of the KSG's dual tube. Um, it's kind of out there to uh, compete against the like Remingtons and the like Mossberg 500 crowd. Okay. Um, lightweight um, MSRP right under 500 bucks. Uh, 500. Like four, okay. Like 475, I believe. Okay. Um, so basically everything's all the same. Uh, uh, the the lifters basically the same. The, the the tube is the same. The barrels technically the same as well. Right. Um, so it shares a lot of common parts and it whatnot. It just seems thinner, obviously, it's, since yep. you don't have two tubes. Yep. You can get a thinner uh, yeah. uh, footprint off yep. with it. Yeah. Exactly. It's and that's thinner and lighter. And yeah. then uh, the, the, the charging handle I think is cool. And then you've yep. got the a sight. Yep. I guess running down. Yeah. Here. It's an integrated carry handle with the optic built in. That's uh. You know, a little fiber optic sight. Okay. So, um, how long is the tube here on this? Um, so standard length, it's uh, just the same as like the KSG, like okay, I said. Same. Okay. So uh, uh, the 18 and a half inch barrel, 28 inch overall length, okay. all that good stuff. So we can get uh, how many how many shells? In here? Seven in there. Seven. And then okay. one in the chamber. Okay. Is it good with the mini shot shells? Um, Have you guys not tested that? not as uh, not as prevalent just yet, and we haven't done as much testing with that yet. Okay. But, uh, I'm sure I'm sure it will be. I know someone that could test. Yeah. And figure that out for you. <laughs> but, Very um, cool, man. And so, do you know how much? How much weight are we saving overall on this? Um, I don't know overall savings, but I know okay. it's about five and a half pounds uh, dry. So, I think I will, you know, everyone's got those, um, this kind of those like uh, legal shorty shotguns everyone yep. has. I would rather have this because I think I'd have a little bit more control. Those are cool. Yeah. Those are cool. I, yeah. You know, I'm not against them at all, but I like the fact of having the control and everything. Yeah. Factor. So, and I know I asked you off camera, but I'll ask it again. Are you guys, um, are you going to do an SBS version? Not, not planned yet. Uh, okay. We actually have the opposite. We have a 28 inch barrel long, and yeah, uh, we actually, long, yep, yeah. and we have a uh, tube extender and stuff. So you can go to yeah. 10 rounds. Right. Yeah. But, um, yeah. not my favorite. Are you guys selling a lot of those? Um, we, we haven't really started like official sale yet on it. In fact, uh, that'll be happening basically this week. Oh, okay. But um, once we start to ramp up production, I, I think that'll I think it'll okay. sell. And who who what market uh, are the longer ones? For? Um, kind of more the hunting crowd and whatnot. Okay. It'll be it'll be a uh, 28 inch barrel, but you'll still have you know super short overall length because of the bullpup. Right. Okay. So. Okay. Makes sense. Makes yeah. sense. Yeah. I like the shorter, smaller, lighter Me stuff. Me too. Keltec obviously yeah. is known for. It. Yeah. Yeah. We we try to cater to the crowd. So, yeah. You know. Yeah. Now now the next thing that we're gonna go to is super highly anticipated. People have been asking you guys to do this for a while. Yep. Uh, what is it called? The so, C33. So CP33. Okay. So competition pistol. 33 rounds okay uh, basically this is a um, pistol version of kind of the uh, CMR carbine that we have it's basically got the same type of bolt um, and magazine and, and uh, frame yeah. configuration. Is it the same exact magazine, just adapted for 22? No, in, in fact, it's actually a completely new magazine, top completely to bottom. New. Okay. Uh, it actually kind of quad stacks. It's a uh, oh, right. really oh. okay. wild setup that yeah. uh, oh, cool. our engineer okay. came up with. It's really neat. So no feeding issues or anything? No, in fact, this one's actually uh, pretty darn good. Okay. Uh, I haven't really had any problems with it, okay. um, and I've shot a good amount through them. Okay, nice. And um, obviously ready to use the suppressor. Yeah, the suppressor uh, ready. It actually really is uh, kind of built for suppression. Um, it's got the long, long uh, uh, pick rail at the top for you know having a good sight radius and all that. Um, it's just pretty good overall yeah, nice. uh, little, yeah. little 20 pistol. So this is more of like a competition thing? Yeah, um, yeah. it's kind of designed to go against something like that Ruger Mark IV or something okay. like that. Okay, very you know? nice. So let me ask you with the magazine, how many rounds? 33. 33, okay. I think I saw somewhere that you can get 50 in there, is that true? It's Yeah, there's a uh, add-on that we're looking to try and make as well, um, if there's, uh, yeah. if there's you know, interest in it. But yeah, it just is like an add-on that adds another like oh, 20 rounds. Oh, nice, nice. How easy is it? 
wanted to make it go full auto, man. Oh, uh, we haven't done any full auto. You guys haven't on tested the full auto one. <laughs> I'm sure we've tested it. But uh, for civilian. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. Okay. Yep. All right, cool. And uh, just go over the price points again. So both of them MSRP of right under 500. Uh, oh, both of them right around. One. Yep. Okay. Right around 475. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. And uh, you guys, so once production ramps up, you guys will actually be making these oh, in, yeah. in volume. Oh yeah. There's. Okay. We're looking at uh, doing uh, quite a few. I think it's about 750 a week of these. Okay. And I think about 500 of these a week. Okay, so. good. I mean, because one of the things that happens is when you guys come out with new stuff, everyone yeah. gets crazy. They overpay for yeah. it. But if the production is actually out there, then there's no need for you yeah. to get crazy. It should be. It should be. It should be one of our better releases. I think. Okay. Uh, we we've uh, we've already kind of got these uh, like in process, you know. So basically, just parts supply is kind of what's going to limit our our um, you know ramp up of the production, and that's generally like vendor parts. Mostly. Okay, cool. So. All right, so I know it's loud and crazy out here. I'm gonna wrap up here in a second, but we'll go back and check out Keltec in the booth at the show. If you want to see, you want people to have more access to stuff now. Yeah, of course, yeah, and that's why we design the way we do. It's all civilian market stuff, you know. Yeah. So I mean, we want we want people to have cool, innovative guns, and you know, that, yeah. that's kind of the dream. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Thanks, Andrew. Thanks for coming on, man. Good seeing you again. Shout out to everyone else in the family. You know who we're talking about. <laughs> All right, here we go. Putting in a magazine and chambering. Okay, let's see. Oh, safety. Oh, man, that's so light. Oh, that's, that's so much fun. <laughs> Okay, looks like, uh, what's this, is it a silencer co? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. yeah. No, that's cool, man. I really like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice little setup. It's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. We gotta load this up now. Yeah. All right. Pump all the way forward. And then I, I just kind of, I load it like that. Makes it super easy. Okay. Just drop it in. Am I shooting at the same thing? Probably. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yep. All right, I'm gonna definitely have to add one of those too. I like the weight of it. Right? Yeah. Super light. 